uh, yeah, the display will be fixed soon. I know it's in a window now. That will be fixed soon. The... Hang on, just gotta find uh, where did this cord go? Oh, it's, it's down there now. Okay, bring that over here. <clears throat> Okay, let me get the window back on. Wait a second now. Bring that over there. Uh, that one, okay. And I just gotta fix my Twitch window. Okay, you are good to, to start. Uh, it was this was not hard mode. <clears throat> so since last time, I have actually restarted the game. Um, I'm in caution health. Oh, uh, actually, I'll wait till I'm in danger before uh, healing. So yeah, I've rest I restarted the game because I it turns out I had missed a whole bunch of inventory. Uh, the uh, fanny packs uh so i missed a whole, a whole bunch of them missed the, i missed at least one like at least two of them so figured it was probably best to just restart the game and and get those because probably going to be very important later on like it's like this what i have in my inventory i had this but like no free space so it was it was pretty bad um especially since at this point in the game you have four weapons not counting grenades you have the shotgun uh, the regular handgun, the mag, which, uh, you know, I assume they, all these weapons have their own use. And you got grenades, you got a knife, and even then, there's still... I have a lot tucked away. I've, I've actually been doing pretty good with resource management this game. So, um, yeah, I got explosive rounds. By the way, I'm not playing on easy. I am still playing on normal, so before, before anyone jumps to that conclusion. You got the regular handgun still. Uh, so there's this one, which is the burst model. It shoots three at a time. Uh, I'm not not using. I mean, that's the one I'm using. I'm not using the regular the G19. I'm not sure which is better, honestly. This one only shoots one at a time. I think by this point in the game, the zombies are are a bit hard, tougher, so uh, it's probably best to uh, go with the the three shooter. I still have the grenade launcher too. I should probably take that out. I feel like I'm going to need it. Um, but the problem is, if I take that out, will I also need these guys? I don't know. Like, you, you have no way of knowing if you're going to need them or not. And I don't want to take up too much space in my inventory because... Uh, so... You, know, you don't know what you could be picking up. You know, you want to you want to save room for stuff you're going to be picking up later on. Uh, what is the mag for? I just remember... I know it's just like a really powerful pistol. I remember that from the first game. That first game. The, the RE2. Uh, hmm. So it's currently loaded with flame rounds. 
I think I'll just I'll take some explosives out too, and just leave three three spaces for whatever I pick up. And I can always just come back here, I guess, to unload stuff as I as I find more stuff because there's a safe room right here. Uh, so anyway, I, I did. Um, so the last time I left off, I was actually I think I was still in the hospital. I was just leaving the hospital. So I was like right around the area where you finally get through this door, the part where you finally get through this door. So I did like the big fight with Carlos, uh, gave Jill the vaccine, and I think at that point was when I was like, well, I have no inventory space, I probably should restart. So um, that's what I did. Uh, so I did I did a little bit. I, you know, I went through the door. There's not much over here. There's not even any zombies to fight in this whole corridor. Uh, there's just a few items to pick up. Uh, then you take the elevator up. God damn it. <laughs> Let's reload. <laughs> I don't want to waste any ammo. I mean, I have a fuck ton of ammo. What am I... But, still. I don't want to waste any ammo. <laughs> uh, so, anyways, I was as I was explaining, I, I cl did clear out all the hospital. As you can see, all the rooms are blue. Unlike last time, where I left a few of the Hunter Betas alive because I didn't want to kill them. Realized that they're super easy to kill with a shotgun, so that's that's nice. Um, once, so once you take control of Jill, you can take them out pretty easily. When you're Carlos, it's a bit harder. Uh, you can throw a grenade at him if you have, but the, uh, the automatic weapon you have doesn't do much damage against him. So yeah, I got all the items, and, uh, even, I got the achievement for unlocking all the, uh, locks, I think. I'm not, actually, I might have missed one lock, but... I know I was able to throw out the lock pipa, so that's... At least that's out of my inventory now. Okay. Without... Okay, so... Grenade is two. Shotgun is three. Keep the shotgun handy, because that's just so much more useful than the pistol. <clears throat> um... I still should keep the pistol around, though. Just because. Oh. Oh, isn't that the guy that, like, tried to kill me? Fucker. Uh, let me just drop that off, because... I don't need that right now. It's enough space. <clears throat> Fix my posture. Okay, I can't go down the stairs. Can't move that ladder two two inches. I guess not. Okay, I guess I jump down. guys well some of the some of the zombies like even if you knife check them and they don't wake up I realize that some of the zombies are scripted to just come alive at certain points of the game so learn that the hard way oh shit I must admit I respect your tenacity but I'm afraid our games end here I expected these zombies to wake up Whoa! Hello. You're a nasty looking fellow. Yeah. 
All right, I guess I'll. Hmm. I have plenty of shotgun ammo. I should really just use that more. Okay, cool. I got one of the three fuses. This is video game generosity, as I like to say. Just equip it manually. Oh! Shit. Oh, God! Hello. There's another one. Okay, okay, I'm alive. Uh, let's switch the shotgun now. Cause I don't know how much, how much mag ammo I really have. Uh, this is just the way back up. Alright, so I don't need that. I don't need to do that. No more dogs. No more zombie dogs. dark in here. I don't like it. There's a zombie. That's just... Oh, God! The fuck? What was that? I slide a sidle through this narrow passage. Oh boy. <laughs> um oh, I didn't bring the uh it's fine, I'll just wait. Shotgun. Shit, shit, shit. I'm 
the graphics make it look like there's something behind me. Employee memo. So 12, admitted to N2, male 45, female 32, discarded male 60, female 89. September, right, I'm not reading all this. So. Transfer reserved by nurse, admissions on the ground, halted. Shotgun shells, thank you. I have plenty of gunpowder to craft more, but just to be safe, I like to kind of extras. Uh, so this is kind of takes me. That's, this probably takes me back to the safe room. Yes. Okay. Good. Uh, let's get some of the stuff here. Just ammo taking up space. I got, I got plenty of space, I should be alright. So wait, what was that door over there? I want to see what this is all about. This lift. What does this do? Okay, so that connects these two areas. So I can take it up. Let's see what's over here. Handgun ammo. Yay. Still stuff in this room, though. Well, I guess I gotta go here now, so let's go there. Explode any second. Oh, hello. Whoa. Okay. <sighs> uh, ammo. Shotgun ammo. You know what? I better switch to the, um, Switch to this gun. <laughs> so I don't know how long I'm going to be streaming today. I can only only handle this game in short bursts, anyways. <laughs> so uh, this might be pretty short. I don't know. We'll see. But uh, I do. At least plan on streaming the rest of the game, so it will, it will be streamed. It'll just it might take me some time. Well, I don't think there is much left left of the game, to be honest. I don't, don't know. All right, let's see. Uh, I would very much like. To, I would feel much more comfortable being able to use my shotgun. So. How do I get shotgun shells? It's just high grade versus um, combined high grade with regular. Okay. Do, 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 do. 
Let's see how much that gets me. Six. Thanks, game. Thanks. Well, it's better than nothing. Uh, I can put that away. Organize things a little bit better. Um, hmm, I should uh, should craft an herb. Actually, I already have an herb here. Well, let's craft another. Well, let's actually store that and then take this one out. Yeah, I'm, I'm good on healing. I got three full heals here. Actually, four if you if I combine these three green ones. Okay, I got a red one down there too. <clears throat> So we actually have one, two, three, four full heals. Plus five. Plus, uh, I'm sorry, five total. All right, not bad. <sighs> uh, let's save. Plus some crazy. So let's see. What else is? Where, where did I not explore in here? I only saw two fuses. I must have missed one somewhere. I guess I should just look for the area that has light, right? So let's see. So that's the first one I took. Control for this thing? This looks like it looks like it's an elevator that goes up. Hmm. Okay, so let's see. I have to slide through here again. There's got to be something it's doing that I'm missing. Mm -hmm. Oh. Shell holder? Oh. Well, that's cool. I'll take that. It's still red. So there's still something else in here. Just increases the capacity. 
capacity. Good. Gladly take that. Uh, let's go up. That's probably. Oh, yeah, looks like there's an exit on this side I didn't take. Okay. I do hear something moving around still, so. Oh god. Hello. What the fuck? What the fuck? Oh shit. Oh, what the fuck is that? I, I, I should have brought my grenade launcher. Wait, I have this. Okay, I wasted a grenade there, but whatever. And I thought I had seen the last of those guys when I left the sewer. Alright, let's just pick up the ladder. Got the third fuse. Not sure why the room is still red, but... I want to make sure. I just want to make sure I'm not missing any items. I'm, uh... Very anal about that. Especially when you like this. Uh, I don't think I need to blow in that. Actually, I should make some more. Not a fan of the fact that I used all my grenades. But we must press on. I do still have the grenade launcher with plenty of ammo. Oh yeah. Yep, I knew this was scripted. I knew it.
Oh, there's all the shotgun ammo I just crafted. Why are they still wiggling? Does that mean they're still alive? Yep. Ow. Oh, they got range. Oh, they're fucking... That's great. What is that shit? I really wish I brought my, uh, you know what? See if it was right there, and I just saved. So let's redo that. I'm taking my fucking rocket launcher, uh, grenade launcher this time. Alright. Okay. This is right. Uh, let's put, put the mag away for now. I'm not really using it. Take the explosive rounds. Mine rounds in the. I feel like I might need those for something later. Uh, let's sort. I've got my recovery. I think I am good to go. Okay. Uh, shortcut. Shortcut. That'll be number two. Flame rounds are the good ones. Not on fire. Yo, what the fuck? are back on. I suppose I could have just made a run for it. I wonder how that would have worked. Of course he's gone. Why would he still be here? Shit. He got away. What was he doing in here? Okay, good guy. I got through. They're willing to negotiate. Ah. They'll call out the strike if, and this is one big ass if, we can deliver the vaccine to them before they launch. <laughs> How long do we have? Hours, maybe. Then let's not waste one more second. This way.
Alright, is there anything else in this room? Because apparently I missed something. the mag. Cool. There's still something in that room. What the hell? Maybe I can't get to it yet. Whatever it is. We'll find the vaccine up ahead. Uh, I don't have much shotgun ammo left. Let's, um... Run. So you don't need to stop? Stop and do what? I got your back. All right. Let's get this done. I feel like something's coming up. Um, so... Let's make sure that has the right ammo in it. Back to the mag. Okay. Oh, that's, uh, that's Nemesis, isn't it? Well, he's dead. Oh. Oh. Ah, well, never stopped him before. How is that fucker still alive? Achievement.
check what that button downstairs did. Probably nothing. It said locked. But. Okay, I need a thing. Probably an ID card or something. In the safe room. Objectives of this T virus research facility differ from those of Umbrella's main nest facility. Here we focus on real world use cases which arise as new viral weapons are created and introduced, such as the need for T virus vaccines and new weaponry capable of suppressing viral weapons. Some aspects of our work can be dangerous, so it is imperative that all employees adhere to work workplace regulations without fail, in particular, unauthorized entry by unapproved visitors or the removal of work-related data or materials will be met with severe disciplinary measures. It is, a, it is a great honor to be part of the finest research organization in the world. Keep this in mind and stick to the rules as we forge new and revolutionary technologies. Ooh, I got a map. Okay. Um, was there two? There was multiple floors here. going on here. Hey. Getting very ominous. Override key successfully generated. What have we here? Override key removed. Well, that's probably how I get through that door downstairs. Did that wake up any zombies?
Let's see on vaccine synthesis, on the roles of antigens and adjuvants in vaccine synthesis. Dr. Nathaniel Barr, Chief Researcher, Spencer Memorial Hospital. To most efficiently synthesize a vaccine, both an antigen and an adjuvant are required. The antigen produces an immune response, whereas the adjuvant increases the effects of such responses, leading to, the, in, leading to increased antibody production. By combining samples of these two ingredients, one can create a potent vaccine base. By processing this vaccine base with a proprietary equipment, a larger batch of vaccine can be created with astonishing ease. What's more, by my, my latest antigen and adjuvant samples uh, yield um, unprecedented, unprecedented rates of antibody production, producing more than 1,000 times the yield of traditional materials. This is not this not only makes it, it an effective vaccine, but also a potential way to eliminate the existing infections. something in this room. Got that. Unless it's counting the vaccine puzzle or whatever I'll deal with this later. <clears throat> So, no better than to trust the zombie that looks like they're dead. Is that Graves' diary? The pay, <clears throat> the pay was generous. The benefits were good. Most importantly, they promised me I'd be contributing to the state-of-the-art medical tech research for a university teacher stuck working in nowhere America. It was a golden opportunity, like winning the lottery. So I went for it. I made the pitch to my family, and we agreed to move here to Raccoon City. Well, hindsight is twenty twenty because this lab is a den of monsters who conduct cruel and barbaric experiments for the sole purpose of taking human life in the most sickening way possible. It's messed up. The world needs to know. At every, but every time I work up enough courage to blow the whistle, I think of Penny and Casey and immediately checking out. Umbrella owns this town. They, there was this guy, they, they caught trying to smuggle out company secrets. They essentially fed him to, to one of the betas. Fed him. I saw the whole thing. I got my wife and daughter into this. I just need to do my job. Uh, do as I'm told for their sake, but let, the, let this be testament that I do have a conscience and that I've learned my lesson. Gunpowder. More fucking gunpowder. Game's very generous with gunpowder. Alright, well now that I have that USB drive, let's go downstairs and open that door. I'm sure there's going to be zombies alive now. No? No, not yet. Okay. Well, let's go save. some of this stuff. <laughs> Do 
Okay. Key. Key, 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 key. Even, oh, there's a USB port there. Now you wake up? You gonna wake up now? No, no, no. I know they, they're gonna wake up. They're gonna wake up at some point. I know this game. I know how this game be. Oh, hello. you. There's a shadow up there. Let's bag this guy. This, these are the powerful ones. Yeah, these guys are strong for some reason. I don't know what their deal is. Hear you? Or is it me? I'm pretty sure there's another one in here. Yeah, there you are. Let's see what's down here first, then. <clears throat> oh, three people watching. Oh, boy. Three people want to watch me get shared settlers. <sighs> I was expecting maybe one or two. <laughs> All right. Cargo Nemesis. We're going to learn about Nemesis here. Shipping route from Charles de Gaulle to JFK to... I don't know what that one is. Um, <clears throat> September 1st, 1998. Oh, all transit within the United States is to be made via a helicopter. Take extreme care during takeoff and landing as a shock to the parcel parcel may potentially lead to self-activation. So wait, this this came from France. This is Charles de Gaulle's in... Assuming that's what CDG stands for. Uh, we here at the European branch are... Yeah, okay. Are excited to hear your thoughts and evaluation of this newest prototype and are pleased to make this... I'm pleased to offer this specimen to you for testing. It has been through numerous trials and, and possesses incredible destructive power, so please exercise extreme caution when using it. How the hell did they manage to fly it over? I guess they froze it or something. Uh, it looks like they, yeah, they had, they had some way of restraining it because it was, okay. Some way of deactivating it. I'm probably going to have to find some way to deactivate it. Maybe. Yeah, yeah. What was that? What was that? Chocolate chips. I'll take that. Yeah, I'll take that. Should I go upstairs first? There was something upstairs.
You're gonna wake up. Yeah, you're too healthy looking. I knew it. More lore. Weaponry authorization request. Dear Dr. Emerson, I would like to formally request that the weaponry normally reserved for the bioweapon synthesis team be made available for any employees interfacing with the admission and disposal of test subjects. These test subjects do not present the same levels of danger as our bioweapon products, but I believe that this weaponry authorization is advisable as outlined below. Recently, some test subjects have developed a new mutation granting them very high regrowth abilities. Oh no. Our team refers to these specimens as pale heads. They have been appearing with regularity, but the specific are these the naked zombies that I've been seeing? They've been appearing appearing with regularity, but the specific cause has not yet been re been determined. The astonishing rate at which these pale heads regenerate makes it difficult to deliver a lethal blow with standard weaponry. If any sort of system failure were to occur within our facility, it would, we would be woefully underprepared to defend ourselves. And yes, that, that, that I'm sure that yep. Uh, for this reason, I would like to request that high-powered weaponry capable of subduing the Pale Heads uh, be issued to all of our employees working in shipping and processing. This will ensure that in the event of an emergency, we will be able to quickly eliminate the threat and evacuate safely. Thank you very much for your cooperation. Consideration, uh, shipping and processing manager, Gabrielle Reed. Well, that at least explains why there's guns everywhere. Fucking Pale Heads, okay. That's, so I'm not sure if that's... The naked zombies that I've been seeing, or if this, this is something else they're referring to. Alright, I'm guessing. Culture sample. Huh, an antigen sample. I'll definitely need this for the vaccine. Yes, yes you will. Why did the music change? Okay, so I gotta go through that door, it looks like, and check out what's in this room. Oh! Are you a pale head? Actually good on health. All right, a little bit, maybe another 10, 15 minutes, and I'm gonna call it. Um, let's check out this area. I have a feeling some sh some shit's gonna happen. Uh, let's get the mag out. Scientist dying message. 
It's happened. Our worst case scenario, the T-virus has somehow leaked. Under orders from Dr. Bard, I'm to manufacture mass quantities of the vaccine. I prepared a culture of the T-virus antigen. Now I just need to combine it with the adjuvant to en enhance its effects. And I should be able to produce enough vaccine to save all the surviving citizens. So I think I've got the antigen. I just need the other thing. The adjuvant samples are stored in the incubation lab. Uh, test subjects are already wandering the halls, but I better find a way to get some stamp samples while this culture is maturing. Uh, if I don't make it back, please complete the synthesis process. Try to find a way to stop this outbreak. It's the least we can do after setting these horrifying events in motion. Whew. Red herb. What's great is that the knife doesn't uh, break in this game. Unlike Resident Evil 2, where it breaks after three uses. Oh, fuck that shit. This must be what powers it. Hello. Someone else is here. Or is that me? I think it's just me making that noise. Alright, what's in here? Spray! Thank you. Everything is blue. Something's going to go down. So let's get this ready. room. Game's auto-saving. I don't like it when the game auto-saves. That's all the mag ammo I have? I know I can craft more.
That makes acid rounds? Sure, I don't know what... Hmm. I haven't seen those yet. box in here. Well, something's definitely going to go down. I'm going to go back and deposit and save and then see what's going to happen. Let's put some stuff away. Uh, I don't think I'm going to need those yet. Let's uh, put that away, that away. Keep that on me. Okay. Um, sort. Okay. Good on recovery. I just need one on me. I want to take. So hand, yeah, I think I need handgun ammo. Oh, I got handgun ammo. Actually, it just—it was just tucked away. Um. Okay, in that case. Way. Take that out. So, I'm good on the main two ammos. Let's make some mag ammo. Uh, that is two high grades. Two high grades. How much do I get out of this? Yeah, I feel like it'd be like four bullets. Well, it's better than nothing. Uh... supposed to be scarce it is a very good weapon Missing something in here because the room is still red on the map. Let's 
kind of hugging the wall, seeing if I missed any items lying around anywhere. Oh, it's not this room, it's the next room. Should be more fucking uh, gunpowder. He's been more than generous with that lately. Although, I could use more high grade gunpowder, to be honest. Not regular gunpowder. What did I just say, game? Before I open that, what else is in here? Expression of concern. Senior fellow Dr. Frankel, please allow me to send, extend my heartfelt congratulations to you and your colleagues at Umbrella Europe for completing Nemesis, a truly remarkable achievement in the field of bioweapons research. Introducing a parasitic organism into a tyrant's brain to gain external control of it? How could I not marvel at such a wild idea? However, however, from a medical perspective, I must empath emphatically state my disapproval of this shift away from established umbrella policy. By, tur by turning to the use of parasites, you are setting a dangerous precedent. Viruses can be kept in check. I believe an effective vaccine can be developed for any virus on Earth uh, with abundant funding for and a bounty of sample samples, of course. Yep. Uh, can you say the same for parasites? However, doctors have tried in vain to develop a vaccine for malaria. Parasites have plasmodium. Pa parasites like pl plasmodium are far, far more genetically complex than the T virus, and to think they will submit to control is utter folly. Perhaps in your country, consumers are willing to buy automobiles with no brakes, but here in America, they know better. Wow. Uh, then again, I recall you have a degree in economics, so no doubt you've already devised a brilliant marketing strategy to win over the naysayers. I look forward to your talk at the Forum in Berlin next month. In the meantime, I shall be exploring medical solutions to this hubristic problem you've foisted upon, upon us. Sincerely, Nathaniel Bard. So it's called the Nemesis. Yes, it is. Alright, let's see what's in here. <clears throat> An adjuvant sample. These are combined with antigens to increase immune system response. <coughs> Alright, something's about to go down. And I said that like the last two times and nothing happened, so we'll, we'll see. Something's gonna happen now. Do it. I knew it. I knew it. I knew it. I fucking knew it. Okay. 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 Get the fuck out of here. Get the fuck out of here. Oh, I can't. The door's locked. What the fuck?
Okay. I think I'm done. <laughs> that uh, that was enough to make me say enough for tonight. Um, so let me just put all this stuff away. Next episode, we will put the vaccine together and see what happens. See what crazy shit comes after me when I do that. Okay. On that note, thank you all for watching, and I'll see you next time.